Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm reunboxing my bookish box, uh, Young Adult November and December book box and goodies. Um, so they decided to ship out the November, um, Young Adult December and November together. So there, everything's inside here. So there's two books and then the items as well. And I think they're doing the same thing with the adult books as well. As well. So I'm getting the adult November and December probably like in a week or two. <sighs> finally, they're finally here. So I'm so happy. Um, but they're obviously still behind because it is March and this is just November, December of last year. So they're still quite behind. But yeah, I already opened everything because they arrived last night and I couldn't help myself. But yeah, so this is the November Young Adult and the December Young Adult. Um, so yeah, um, so I don't know how exactly I'm going to film this. Um, I'm just going to take out the items as they come out. And I'll tell you if it's from the November box or the December box. So um, yeah, so let me just go ahead and open the box here for these um, spoiler cards um, so I can tell you which one is from which because so the November theme was Shades of Magic that was the theme for November and then for December it is um, Deadly Devotion so yeah that was the theme for December so let's finally go ahead and see what we have. So the first big item is a Zodiac Academy blanket. I feel like I've been getting a lot of blankets in my subscription boxes, which I'm not complaining because I like blankets. Um, and I feel like you just never have too many. Um, so yeah, this one's very soft, so they're very nice. Um, and it's nice and long. So this is inspired by Zodiac Academy and it just has the two main characters from the book. I'm gonna insert a clip so you guys can see this better. But yeah, um it's a nice design. Though I wish it didn't have people on it to be honest, but it looks nice though. And it feels nice so I like it. I like blankets. They're nice to receive. Um, and this one is really soft. So I love it. Um, I haven't read Zodiac Academy, but I am interested in reading it. So yeah, that is the first item. And that was, um, inspired, that is for the November um, box. So that was for the November box. And then we have the next item here is this which is um, a Court of Thorns and Roses inspired crossbody bag um, and the artist was the British box so somebody from their team designed this. Um, I just received one of these uh, fanny packs um, from Illumicrate I think it was and I didn't like it um, and I don't like this <laughs> just because I don't gonna get any use out of this one or any of these crossbody bags but I do will say this has embroidery on it so that's really nice um and there's three main pockets here um so it is pretty nice but I just I'm not gonna get any use out of it just because I don't use these type of things um so I do like the design it's pretty simple it says don't let the hard days win and then this it has some like sparkles right here um, so it is pretty pretty, um, and I wouldn't, you wouldn't know, it's inspired by Court of Thorns and Roses, um, so it's really nice, but, um, like I said, I'm just not gonna get any use out of it, so, it's fine. <laughs> and that was part of the December, um, box, so yeah. <laughs> so the next thing I'm seeing here is a Throne of Glass teacup, um, from CJ Mass, and, yeah. So we have a teacup set here, so that's really nice. I know people like receiving these. Um, I, on the hand, I like them. Um, so they're nice to receive. So we have this right here. It's very small though, but the art is nice. Um, so I do like it. It's very cute, but it's also just very, very small. Um, and then we have the saucer here 
and this I love this is really pretty uh, but yeah I think that looks nice and then you just place your teacup on top and it looks beautiful so I really like these um, they're very, very cute um, and they look good so yeah and the teacup and uh, to keep the teacup and saucer is from the December um, box okay so the next thing I'm seeing here is a enamel pen and this is inspired by six of cranes um, and it says find the light that makes your light light lantern shine uh, this is really pretty I like this um, I like receiving enamel pens so they're nice and I do like this one um, and this one like kind of dangles as well so this is really nice and this is from the November box okay and then I think the last so each box um, in their young adult box at least for 2022 um, they came with weaponary bookmarks so we had those and then each box also come with candles so those are the last four items i'm gonna show you and then we want to go to the box so let me show you the weaponary bookmarks first because i love these um so the first one here um i don't know where it is so let's take it out so this one is inspired by the five crowns of orcruff or orcruff something like that <laughs> So here is the weaponary bookmark and I love these. These are my favorite things to receive in these boxes because they're so pretty and I love them. And I don't have a whole box of these, um, but I'm kind of sad because these are the last ones that we will be receiving because this was the collectible item for 2022 and then for 2023 um, is a different item. So these will be the last ones we'll be receiving, but I love these so it'll be kind of sad that those are won't be available no more um and that one is for um i think that one is in the november box yes so that one is from the november box here i'm pretty sure yeah so yeah and then let's go ahead and open the last one so this one is our last weaponary bookmark that we're receiving and i hope that they keep making these and just make new ones but put them in their bookshop that they have so yeah this one i really like this one is in black um and it's very very pretty these this one is from a court of thorns and roses so i really like this one this is so pretty i love these and then that one is in the december box yeah this one is from the December box um yeah, these, I love these. They're my favorite things to receive. <laughs> okay, so now we have the candles here. So we have Sega Taurus and Capricorn. And let's just do this one first. I think this one comes first. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure this one is from the November box. From November 22nd to December 21st. And this one is Victory and Rowan from Throne of Glass. They're um, featuring a lot of their masks and their boxes, I noticed. Which I'm a fan with, even though I only read one book from Terry Jamas, which is um, Crazy City, House of Earth and Blood. But uh, I own all of her books. <laughs> so you have this design on the label there, which is really, really pretty. I really like it. Um, and it smells really good. Um, yeah, it smells really good. Don't know what the scent, to be honest, couldn't tell you. So I wish they would include, like, sent somewhere but they don't anyways we have the capricorn and this one is from december 21st to january 20th and this one features uh damien from lux so let's take the kettle off so i can show you guys um here we have the label i think the labels are so pretty i really like it and it also so it's really good <laughs> again i couldn't tell you the scent of it um i wish they would include the scent oh they do um so we have a whole bunch of things i i can't really pronounce these things so yeah read the candle section right there for the november box if you're interested in the scent and then uh for the december one um this one the december one is just um green floral 
um, moss and possum, so. <laughs> those are the sand for those. So now we're moving into... Oh, before we have move into the box, actually, we have art prints. So here's one art print here, which is beautiful. And then here's the other art print, which is also very, very gorgeous. Um, I like the art prints, they're very, very pretty. So yeah, um, now we have the books. Um, so there's two, so we have a naked hardback and then we have um, one that is not naked. So let me figure out which one is the November box book and we'll go with that one first. Okay, so for the November box, it is The High Mountain Court by A.K. Milford. So this one is a naked hardback, which usually I am not a fan of naked hardbacks. I like to have a dust jacket on them, but this is absolutely beautiful. Um, the gold foiling on here is nice. And then we have the spine there and then the back we have that which again very very pretty and it says the world would not make her she will make the world so that's really nice and then the thing that i love that they decide to do with the naked hardback is that they added these like gold ends on the corners there which looks so nice i love it um yeah i think that just makes it a lot better to be honest these gold clippings on the naked hardback uh they look nice and then the sprayed edges here the ones on top they look stunning and then the ones on the bottom as well they look really nice and then i love um on the sprayed edges there they look so nice i love these sprayed edges they look so good um the arrow like the sun and some flowers they look really nice so i'm a huge fan of that and then we have the end pages here um they look good um they're the same on the front and back sadly i wish they would do different in pages but they look good so i'm really happy with that and then they're also signed by the author which i'm happy about we have color artwork here so that's really, really pretty i like that and i think that's it for this one uh, we have a map in here, but I will say it's very blurry, so I don't know if you can see that. It's a very low quality map, so that's interesting, um, but yeah, that's the bug. It's beautiful. Don't know why the map is so low quality, but this is such a pretty book and I really love it. It's so nice. So I'm really happy with this. Um, yeah, it's gorgeous. So yeah. Anyways, now we're moving into the December book, which is Bow Before the Elf Queen. And I love this cover. This cover is redesigned and it's gorgeous. And I love the holographic um, folding on it, if you can see, hopefully. I think that's gorgeous. And then we have the spine there, which also has a holographic um, text, which is gorgeous. And then on the back, it does have the same um, holographic phoning as well, which is really, really nice. And it says, uh, love is a powerful force. It cannot be bought. It cannot be taken or stolen. Although sometimes it must be fought for. It must be given freely. So that's a really nice quote. Um, so I love that. So let's go ahead and take off the dust jacket. And before we're looking at the beautiful heart back there, um, this one does have reversible dust jacket art, which I'm actually such a huge fan of. I really like this artwork. Um, the only thing I wish it just had like the title here, um, but it doesn't. But we have the same beautiful holographic folding on the back, which I love that Bucket Box does that. Um, that they include folding and stuff on the reversible side. So I do love this a lot, um, and I wish I could have both of them, but yeah, these are really nice, um, and I love that. Um, and then we have the naked hardback here, which this is a gold foiling, but it also has the holographic foiling on it, so this looks beautiful. Uh, so hopefully you guys can tell on there, and then we have the spine there. 
and then the back one. Um, so, this is such a beautiful naked hardback. I really love it. And then we have the top braid edges, which are purple with a flower on it. And the same on the bottom there. So those are really nice. And then we have these beautiful spray edges in the spine there. Um, so that's gorgeous. I love the spray edges. They're really nice. Um, we have a pattern in the pages. Um, they're cute. They're not my favorite, but they are nice. And they're the same on the back as well. So such a beautiful book. Um, it is signed by the author, which again, I love receiving signed copies and then i think that's it um we have a map here which is not blurry so that's good i really like that that's a nice map so now i'm just wondering if they just the author sent them or the publisher sent them a blurry pack map for the other one so here are the chapter headings um they're like design on them so that's really nice uh, i'll show you chapter one yeah, so this is how they look for each chapter heading, which is so nice. Um, yeah, they look really pretty. So, another beautiful book from the Bookish Box. Um, yeah, I love this box. I love both of these boxes. They're very, very nice. The books are... Oh, okay. <laughs> the books are beautiful. So, here are the spray edges together. The spine. These are beautiful books, um, and I love them. They're both so pretty, so I'm very happy with both of these books. Let me know your thoughts on the book designs and what you guys think about them. I think they're really, really beautiful, uh, and I do think it was worth the wait because they're very, very stunning, um, at least to me, they are. Um, I love the candles. I love the metal bookmark that we received. The blanket is very nice. Um, the teacup and saucer, I like them. Uh, the pen. I love the animal pen. The only thing I didn't love was the cross body bag, I think. Um, I think that's everything. So, <laughs> let me know your thoughts on both of these boxes, books, um, and the items. Um, make sure to like, comment below, and hit subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.